Hello, welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. My name is Matthew Bailey and I'm going to talk to you about this 2012 uh, Volkswagen Amarok Highline. Beautiful car. First thing you're going to notice is they've spent a little bit of money on the car with the nice ARB 4x4 bull bar at the front here. Um, nice black with your, you've got your little fog lights in there as well. Um, it does look very nice on this vehicle. Um, you will see also that there is some roof racks on the top there, which is um, another thing which um, these previous owners have obviously, obviously spent a little bit of money on the car. Um, condition wise, um, you're going to find um, a couple of stone chips just here on the bonnet um, have been touched up, so it does look quite nice. It does take your eye off it, which is very good. I'm going to come across to the, the front guard part here, and you're going to find that's in quite good condition. Um, you've got a nice indicator here on your, on your guard there as well. You've got some very nice um, Cooper Discover all-terrain tyres with some very good tread in them, and a very nice untouched alloy wheel there. You've got a little bit of chrome just here, which just sets off the um, colour-coded side mirror there. Um, you will notice the condition of the driver's door is quite good. I can't notice anything really apart from, see, I think that's coming off with my finger. A um, couple of little marks just on the door there. You do have a very nice side step there as well. Back door in quite good condition too. I'm going to be very picky with any marks that I do see on these vehicles. I did touch on these before as well. You do have the, the roof racks on the vehicle, which is also on the back of the canopy, which we'll touch on in a little bit as well. As far as condition, again, all in quite good condition there. Back guard looks quite good on the tub. Can't notice any marks or scratches on the back of that tub at all and another very 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 good tyre here which is a Grand Trek so we've had a little bit of change of tyres um, in these ones still all terrain um, and a, a very good alloy wheel there as well you do have your ARB colour coded um, canopy on the back as well so they have spent a little bit of money as I mentioned before um, you do have the chrome parts here in your little um, your little step uh, your rear step there on the vehicle um, has got a tow bar as well which is 2.8 ton towing capacity it's a couple of little marks just here on the tailgate um, which is quite deep so that's something that is not going to come out but it has been touched up so it has taken your eye off it a little bit um, just going to open up the back of this whilst we're here because we might as well have a little bit of a look inside the canopy um, we are going to see a tub liner in there which is in quite good condition too doesn't look like it's had too much of a hard life um, apart from that there's not a lot more to speak about the inside of the canopy so just going to close that one out of the way and continue on down the passenger side of the vehicle quite good condition again a little mark just here which looks like it's been touched up as well so there was a decent cut there um, apart from that, the overall condition of this, this back part of the tub is quite good. Um, you do have the Dunlop tyre on the rear again of this vehicle with another very good alloy wheel. Another nice side step and very well conditioned back door so I can't notice any scratches or dents or anything like that on here. You will notice you do have window tint in this vehicle as well. Driver's door looks to be very good too there's a little stone chip just here and a tiny little mark there as well and another little stone chip no it's not it's just a little bit of dirt um, it's in quite good condition as you can see there um, even your front guards in quite good condition and you've got another Cooper Discovery all-terrain tire on the front so very good condition good alloy wheels and great overall condition of the vehicle. All right, now we're gonna look under the under the hood here of the uh, 2012 Amarok Highline. Um, and what an impressive little unit this is. You've got a four cylinder, two litre turbo diesel engine. You've got 120 kilowatts of power and 400 Newton meters of torque. 
You have a six speed manual transmission with this vehicle. You're gonna get 7.9 liters per 100 kilometers out of this car. And it's got an 80 liter tank. You're gonna get well in excess of a thousand kilometers of fuel range. That's just absolutely phenomenal. All right, now we're on the inside of this Amarok Highline. And it does look very, very, very nice in here. You do have the leather wrap steering wheel. Um, you don't have any controls on the steering wheel, but that's fine, you don't need them. You got your indicators just on your left and you've got your windscreen wipers on your right being the Volkswagen um, you do have your controls for your windows just here on your right and also your side mirrors just here as well you've got your headlight button just here on the bottom um, and also you can adjust the height of your headlights and you can also adjust um, the inside um, how everything's kind of lighting up inside the car too which is very cool um, we're going to come across to the middle and we will notice that this is an aftermarket Opal unit. So you do have navigation, Bluetooth, DVD, radio, music, and there is some apps as well. So with the apps, you've got link pods, so that'll be for your iPods. Um, you've got auxiliary, you've got rear media, apparently, if there was a setup for it, I don't believe there is. Um, you've got digital radio, uh, apparently you can get TV and um, movies and things like that on this as well so pretty impressive you do have a little book here as well which shows you a little bit about it so it's got your user manual you get a little pen here a remote and a cd there as well which you can um, have a little bit of a look at so all comes with the car you've got your dual zone climate control just underneath that which is quite cool um, very easy to to work this little system here so you've got your fan speed um, your temperatures and where you want it. You've also got your rear demisters and your front demisters as well. As mentioned, you do have the six speed manual um, transmission here. Um, very easy to use as well. Um, your four wheel drive options are just here on your right of it. And just on your left, you've got your rear diff lock. You've got your um, traction control and you've got your downhill descent. You do have two 12 volt ports as well which is very 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 handy and a nice little bit of storage space just here as well you got your two cup holders a very easily accessible handbrake and some decent space in here to to pop whatever you need to cds um, or your gadgets things like that all in there i'm going to get lynn to have a little bit of a look through the interior here and you'll notice that it is in very good condition all the carpets are in very good condition the seats are in very good condition um, everything is just ticking boxes with this car it's been very well maintained it does have four airbags in this car and that gives it a five star and cap safety rating so that is another good thing i'm just going to touch on the service history whilst i have you here and let's have a bit of a look. So, we've got first service done at 10,000 kilometres and then 29,000 kilometres, 51,000 kilometres, 76,000 kilometres, 86,000 kilometres, and 101, 109, and then lastly with us at 120,000 kilometers. So currently it's done 120,273 kilometers. So um, full service history in this car with a lot of aftermarket accessories, um, leaving it a very fantastic valued vehicle. All right, thank you for watching the video with me today on this 2012 Volkswagen Amarok. Uh, what an impressive truck it is. It does tick all the boxes as far as comfort affordability and safety. It does have a lot of options on it, so it'd be great for a, a tradies car with your canopy and your roof racks. Um, could be good for off-roading as well with this nice, nice bar at the front as well. Please be quick, give us a call on 03-9907-0555 and just ask for one of us in the used car sales team. Thanks for watching.